Today's medical-centric topic is estrogen and anti-androgen hormone therapy for gender affirmation. Estrogen and anti-androgen hormone therapy are integral components of gender-affirming treatment for transgender women and non-binary individuals assigned male at birth. Here's an overview of how these therapies work, their benefits, risks, and what to expect during treatment. What is hormone therapy for gender affirmation? Hormone therapy for gender affirmation involves the administration of hormones to align an individual's physical characteristics with their gender identity. For transgender women and some non-binary individuals, this typically includes estrogen and anti-androgens. Estrogen therapy. 1. Purpose. Feminization. Promotes the development of female secondary sexual characteristics. 2. Effects. Skin changes. Softer skin texture. Body fat distribution. Redistribution of body fat to hips and thighs. Reduced muscle mass. Decrease in muscle mass and strength. Decreased body hair. Reduced growth of body and facial hair over time. Anti-androgen therapy. 1. Purpose. Suppress masculinization. Reduces the effects of testosterone. 2. Effects. Reduced testosterone levels. Lowers testosterone production and effects. Slower hair growth. Decreases growth of body and facial hair. Reduced scalp hair loss. May slow male pattern baldness. Decreased libido. Lowered sexual drive. Common medications. 1. Estrogen. Forms. Oral pills, transdermal patches, gels or injections. Common types. Estradol valerate. Estradol cypionate. 2. Anti-androgens. Forms. Oral tablets. Common types. Spirolactone, Cypertrone acetate, and GnRH agonists. Benefits of hormone therapy. 1. Psychological well-being. Gender dysphoria relief. Reduces feelings of gender dysphoria. Mental health. Improves mood and overall mental health. Self-esteem. Enhances self-esteem and body image. 2. Physical changes. Appearance alignment. Aligns physical appearance with gender identity, contributing to social acceptance and personal comfort. Risks and side effects. 1. Cardiovascular risks. Blood clots. Increased risk of thromboembolic events. Stroke and heart disease. Elevated risk, especially in smokers and those with pre existing conditions. 2. Metabolic changes. Weight gain. Possible increase in body weight. Lipid levels. Changes in cholesterol levels. 3. Other risks. Infertility. Potential loss of fertility. Consider sperm banking prior to therapy. Liver health. Risk of liver enzyme changes. Monitoring and follow-up. 1. Regular checkups. Blood tests. Monitor hormone levels, liver function, and metabolic parameters. Health assessments. Regular assessments by healthcare providers to manage side effects and adjust dosages. 2. Mental health support. Counseling. Ongoing psychological support and counseling. Expectations during treatment. 1. Gradual changes. Timeline. Physical changes occur gradually over months to years. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.